for creating a 1980 uh, Chinese TV, uh, shall I say, fever <laughs> by performing at the Spring Festival Gala, mm. uh, two songs that every Chinese could recite even today, mm. and then went to Broadway and coming back, back and forth from time to time to do the Chinese artworks. For me, it's not only been kind of my life's work to um, bridge these cultures, yeah. uh, but it's also personal, uh, frankly, because I'm half American. Yeah. My father's American and uh, my, fa my mother is Chinese from, my, from the very beginning of my career. Mm. The pop music that I was bringing to China at that time was um, just very, very unusual mm. for the audience. Mm. Very Western, the, the instrumentation. Yeah, and then, then um, the Broadway show. After I'd gone to Broadway, um, then I thought, oh, I'll, I'll import Broadway uh, into China. So I worked with Andrew Lloyd Webber, you know, for many years, even to this day, you know, mm -hmm. we're working on um, how to really promote musical theater as an art form in China. Um, so it's always been about bridging cultures. But mm. my only kind of, Slight, you know, sadness is that it's a lot of the traffic has been in one direction, mostly from the west to the east, mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's because obviously, you know, especially America is is very strong um, industry of entertainment. Right. They're very smart in packaging and how to the Hollywood blockbusters, their pop music, you know, all all these years. So. Um, I really hope that in the future, you know, there will be a change in this. Mm. Um, I see some hope in the younger generations mm -hmm. because they're growing up in a much more globalized world. Absolutely. And because of the internet, they're much more world aware mm -hmm. than they have than in the past. You know, so I, I do think there's great hope for the future. Mm. This probably is the most uh, handsome yeah. and most <laughs> gentleman-like uh, bad emperor in China's yeah, yeah. Uh, cinematic history. I really do have to thank uh, Tim for all the work he put into yeah. creation of the gods, not only all the costume design, every prop, every single sword, yeah. every single cup, you know, everything, all the scenic design, all the costumes. We actually filmed it as a trilogy. Yeah. So it's actually three films and we completed filming all in one go. So it was oh, really, see. you know, from beginning to end, yeah. for me, it was one and a half years of filming. Yeah. For Tim, it was much longer because he had to yeah. do all the preparation and construction. Four, four years already into it. Mm. Yeah. Absolutely. Mm. I put that costume on and I already, feel, you know, empowered, honestly. <laughs> you are very diplomatic, Chris. You were not saying that in the green room. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right, let's talk about what we're saying in the green room. Uh, Some green. of the costumes, okay, are pretty revealing, oh, okay. are pretty revealing. So I had to work hard in the gym. Yeah, okay. you were talking, people were talking about a legendary 3 a.m. exercise that yeah, you did because, put into. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but it's really worth it. It was worth it. It's yeah. worth it. Yeah. yeah.